Welcome to today's episode of Financial Insights. In today's segment, we'll be diving into the topic of life insurance and exploring the different options available to individuals. Life insurance plays a crucial role in providing financial security for your loved ones in the event of an unfortunate incident. Joining us today is our financial expert, Sarah, who will help us understand and compare various life insurance policies. Welcome, Sarah. Thank you, host. I'm excited to be here and shed some light on the importance of life insurance and the options individuals have in today's market. Great. Let's start by understanding why life insurance is such an essential component of financial planning. Life insurance is essentially a contract between an individual and an insurance company. In exchange for regular premium payments, the insurance company agrees to provide a lump sum payment, known as the death benefit, to the designated beneficiaries upon the policyholder's death. This death benefit can be used to replace lost income, pay off debts, cover funeral expenses, or even fund future expenses like education or retirement. That's a comprehensive explanation, Sarah. Now, let's delve into the different types of life insurance policies available in the market. Certainly, host. The two primary types of life insurance policies are term life insurance and permanent life insurance. Term life insurance offers coverage for a specified term usually ranging from 10 to 30 years. It provides a death benefit if the policyholder passes away within the term period. Term policies are typically more affordable, making them an attractive option for those seeking temporary coverage during critical life stages, such as mortgage payments or raising children. On the other hand, permanent life insurance offers coverage for the entire lifetime of the policyholder. These policies include whole life insurance, universal life insurance, and variable life insurance and variable life insurance. Permanent life insurance not only provides a death benefit, but also includes a cash value component that grows over time. Policyholders can access this cash value through loans or withdrawals, offering flexibility and potential for wealth accumulation. That's interesting, Sarah. So, when it comes to comparing these different types of life insurance, what factors should individuals consider? When comparing life insurance policies, there are a few crucial factors to consider. First and foremost, you should assess your current financial situation, including your income, assets, and liabilities. This evaluation will help you determine the appropriate coverage amount and policy type. Secondly, it's essential to evaluate your long-term financial goals. If you have dependents who will require financial support for many years, a longer, term policy like permanent life insurance might be suitable. Alternatively, if your needs are more short-term and budget-friendly, a term life insurance policy may be the better choice. Additionally, it's crucial to consider the affordability of the premiums. Different policies have varying premium structures, and it's essential to choose a policy that fits within your budget without straining your financial resources. That makes sense, Sarah. Now, let's talk about the process of selecting a life insurance provider. Selecting the right life insurance provider is crucial as it ensures that your policy is in safe hands and will be honored when needed. When comparing providers, consider their financial strength and stability, customer service reputation, and track record of claims payments. Independent rating agencies like AM Best and Standard, POORS provide valuable insights into the financial health of insurance companies. It's recommended to seek guidance from a licensed insurance agent or financial advisor who can help you navigate the complexities of life insurance and identify the best options based on 